Then the gloves are coming off in the race for mayor. Several of you at home reached out to us through email and on social media about a comment India Walton made about a city lawmaker. Two on your side's Claudine Ewing is looking into it, and tonight we're hearing from both sides. As first reported in the Buffalo News, a Facebook comment posted last year by the Democratic primary winner for Buffalo mayor is insulting and some would say disgusting. Here is the comment, and we have blurred out one of the words about the male anatomy that raised concern. The person India Walton was referring to is Buffalo Common Council member Joe Golumbek, and it was after he voted for the city budget. And because I supported the mayor's budget and because I have supported his reform packet, you know, from day one, um, I was, you know, attacked on Facebook. Keep in mind, this was from 2020, and Golumbek says it was not brought to his attention until this year. She said something about me that if I said about her, I would be forced out of office and uh, forced out of uh, any other job that I possibly had um, because uh, it, was, it, was, it was pretty disgusting. It was sexual in nature. It was also racial. Uh, in nature. Two on your side reached out to the Walton campaign to see if in fact she wrote this and if she had a response. Walton did not shy away from it. She said, as I previously said, I apologize to Councilman Golumbek for my insulting words. That I was outraged and heartbroken at horrible injustice at the time is no excuse, but may provide helpful context for understanding my poor choice. I do believe in the freedom of speech and the freedom of expression, uh, but I do believe that there's also, you know, some common decency, human decency that's out there. And I think that we should be careful with the types of words that we use. Walton, again, showing she's Buffalo, moving forward, said, I'm committed to being more careful with my words in the future. If Mr. Golombek is open to meeting with me so that we can bury the hatchet, I am fully available to him. I let Councilmember Golombek know what Walton said. He told me he will accept her apology, and if she wins, he will be willing to work with her. Claudine Ewing, Channel 2 News.